Sound Transit's light rail extension projects have been riddled with delays, particularly the one taking place in Tacoma's Hilltop neighborhood. Construction delays have frustrated residents in the city, but Sound Transit's leadership says it'll be worth it. In 2016, Washington voters approved a lofty project, expand mass transit across western Washington, linking urban areas in Snohomish, King, and Pierce counties. Sound Transit was tasked with making the goal a reality and has been working ever since. The agency currently has five link extension projects running at the same time. The regional concrete strike and supply chain issues forced the agency to push its deadlines back. Deputy CEO Kimberly Farley says that putting up light rail in so many different places at the same time can be demanding. We've got tunnels, at grade sections, aerial sections, that means bridges, building bridges in the air uh, for long periods uh, along these lines, you're going to have issues. I mean, that's just true. The light rail extension in Tacoma's Hilltop has been particularly challenging. This project was originally scheduled to open next spring, but that opening date has now been pushed back to next fall. Farley says laying out track on a light rail in the residential areas is complex enough but the agency also has to move utilities that were buried underground. One of the lessons learned that we, uh, we have from this project is that the utility relocations, we always know are complex, but in a, a city like Tacoma, which is frankly older and has been around for a while, it creates a, a lot of uh, complexities underground as well. Despite the delays in one project, gains were made in others. Sound Transit's David Jackson says a lot of work was done this year and promises that Sound Transit will make even more headway in 2023 on the Linwood and Federal Way projects. The stations will be getting finished, the parking garages will be getting finished, and you'll see a lot of uh, work that you won't uh, see will be like uh, systems work and electrical work, but there'll be a lot of progress there. Uh, Linwood, the garage will open there at the Linwood Transit Center early next year. Now Farley is asking for Washingtonians for a little more patience. This stuff is really hard and we know we are inconveniencing people and it's going to be worth it. Sound Transit says it's waiting on an environmental impact statement to be completed before beginning construction on the rail line connecting Federal Way to the Tacoma Dome. No word yet on when Sound Transit will break ground, but the project is scheduled to be completed by 2032. From Tacoma, Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.